Hello student, it's a second part of this exercise and in this part we create surface by using these curves and I hope you also create these curves by yourself. So let's start. First we create this fuel tank. So I select this curve. Make sure all the pivot points of these curves in center. like this if the pivot is not in center so geometry will not create in proper way so check in both side top and front so i select this curve and go to surface and choose revolve for creating 3d surface so first reset these settings and the segment value should be around 22 you can increase more for more smoothness but 22 is a decent value or you can also take 26 also and close so this surface is created then select burner curve and then apply revolve again okay and the third curve is grill curve first we check previous created surfaces around the all direction now apply revolve again like this i think the size of this burner curve should be more so just undo and go to side direction if you want to hide this object so select this and go to display and hide hide selection and i hide this object also so i go to display and hide selection okay now we can easily select all these vertices and then move okay i think it's good now go to display and show all okay now I apply revolve okay. so now it's look bigger same as I apply on this glass curve and also apply same as on this retainer curve we apply revolve all these curves and now in the handle and this ring and the support we apply x2 so first I select this circle curve it's for a thickness and then select this profile curve by using shift key and then apply X2 first reset all these settings and the path position should be on at path pivot component and apply and close okay so it's look nice so there is a some problem let's check what is this problem okay so pivot position is not in center so surface not create in proper way so press T and change this pivot position in the center D and press D again and now apply okay now it's look good and now select this vertical support shape and then select this curve and apply extrude okay now I create a mirror shape in the right side so I go to edit and choose duplicate spatial 
place minus one in x axis and a copy apply close so it's a mirror copy now we apply extrude in the ring curve so first select the circle shape and then select this and apply revolve undo we have to apply extrude tool so extrude okay now it's look good okay i think i apply surfacing tools on the all curves now we create a last object this fuel tank cap so it's a fuel tank curve now i apply revolve tool on this so go to surface revolve and this time i choose 16 then go to top viewport now right click and choose control vertices and select these vertices in alternate order by using lasso tool so first i select this one now i scale in the outside like this now choose object mode okay it's look nice now i right click and choose hull and the select last hull and scale inside little bit like this okay first i place at the position first move this center pivot okay Okay, so it's properly positioned. Now I create two circles. First is this. Around this location and create a second one. Around this position. And apply lock on these curve reverse direction okay now i select this and place in the proper position now you can delete all these curves okay we complete the creation of this lantern by using nerves curves if you want to change the wireframe color so just double click on this curve layer and choose index color and save okay so these default color apply on the wireframe so you can also create the different type of models by using these curves Please create your own model and share with me. So thanks for watching this exercise.